Good evening. Much of the nation held its breath this afternoon at first word of gunfire ringing out at the U.S. Capitol, wounding two people, sending tourists scurrying to safety and forcing government buildings into lockdown. It happened, according to police, after a Tennessee man pulled out a weapon in the Capitol Visitor Center, drawing fire from Capitol Police officers. NBC's Peter Alexander has late details. Gotta go. Shooting at the US Terrifying moments at the Capitol. Inside the visitor center, panic. Hey. Capitol police with guns drawn as tourists flee. This way, that way. Get out of here! And they said run. They told everybody, they told everybody to run. At the White House, entrances closed as a precaution in the middle of the annual Easter egg roll. Police say the shooting happened shortly after 2.30 p.m. here at the entrance to the visitor center on the east front of the U.S. Capitol when a man approached the screening checkpoint, a requirement for all visitors. The individual drew what appeared to be a weapon and pointed it at officers. An officer fired and struck the suspect. Officials identify the man as Larry Dawson, age 66, from Antioch, Tennessee, well known to authorities. He was under a court order to stay away from the Capitol. Dawson was arrested last October after this outburst in the gallery overlooking the floor of the House of Representatives. A website for a community church in Tennessee lists Dawson as its pastor, seen here advocating for a raise in the minimum wage. We believe that this is an act of a single person who has frequented the Capitol grounds before, and there is no reason to believe that this is anything more than a criminal act. A woman in the visitor center was also injured. The suspect was rushed to the hospital for surgery. The visitor center was built in part in response to another shooting here in 1998, where a mentally ill man shot and killed two Capitol Police officers. Tonight, law enforcement officials tell NBC News the suspect's weapon was a realistic looking pellet gun. Today's scare came just hours after an active shooting drill here at the Capitol. The chief of the Capitol Police says his system worked. Lester. All right, Peter Alexander. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.